Thanks, Claire. Um, Heather Williams. Online. Uh, thank you. Has that worked okay? Yes, we can hear you, Heather. Go ahead. Okay. So I've got a series of questions and then, then a comment. Um, I think mainly around sort of what analysis has been done in relation to displacement, as others have mentioned, where the avenues and the rat running could occur and whether there's any baseline monitoring being planned to make sure that if this is pursued, then we have that baseline data, because sometimes we've struggled with that in planning in other areas, because we didn't take the right um, analysis before we started. The other one is about what modelling has or will be done to see the impact on emergency services. And I raise that particularly because not just the hospitals, but the police and fire station are very close as well. Um, thirdly, it's been referred to the use of wands. Um, now, some have some cyclists have said that the wands are worse than doing nothing um, for various safety reasons. And we do know that they can be easily knocked and then create hazards and handlebars in between. I'm just wondering what the logic is by using the ones as opposed to other measures. Um, fourthly, how many parking spaces would be lost through the proposal? Uh, it might be none, but I thought on one of the sections of roads where there's currently parking that that was being removed. Um, and can we have an idea of the time scales for the public consultation? I do appreciate and I think it's a good thing that there's going to be multiple options if I've understood the instructions to the report correctly and what's been said uh, because I think that's something you know people need to see various options not just one or, or nothing um, so they're my questions chair my thoughts though when I re was reading through the report I just have my head in my hands a little bit because yeah I'm all for ensuring that all residents have the ability to move around the city and came through as a whole as they wish if that's as a pedestrian or as a cyclist but drivers as well and I really don't don't think this these proposals will help reduce the volume of cars entering the city. I think it will just be displacing it. And at that point, we are no better off. We're just financially down. Um, and yeah, if we really want modal shift, we have to take people with us. And I don't think that doing things like this and proposing band turnings and I don't I don't think that's a way to get people on side.